I am Lily Kump. I am a eighth grader here at New Hope and I went on the Appalachia mission trip in 2023 fall break. Going on the trip, I really didn't know what to expect. We didn't have a lot of information on what we were gonna be doing aside from it being hard work. On the first day of the trip, I asked God to open my eyes and heart so that I could see and feel God moving. And sure enough, I did. Each night we would all sit in the lunchroom of the old school that we were staying in and we would get to talk about and share how we saw God that day. And by the end of the week, I realized that where I saw God the most was in the people I was with, in each other. And the whole week really made me see that for as much darkness as there is in the world now and the future, that there is a light and a fire inside the youth here at New Hope. I learned definitely a lot, but my main takeaway was definitely about teamwork. I have always been a very take charge kind of person, so uh, it was definitely tough at first to step back and let someone else be in control because I had no clue what we were doing and we really just had to figure it out while we were doing it. Um, and it turns out you can't win the ultimate frisbee without a team and you definitely can't demolish a building alone. And it certainly would have been pretty lonely to hike up a mountain all by myself. I realized that like there's maybe maybe a little something to the whole teamwork thing that it's it maybe makes sense a little bit. I have been still continuing to try to work on stepping back and not being so take charge because in John 3.30 it says that he must become greater and I must become less and it's pretty tough to do that day to day but I've been trying to listen more in all areas of my life and God's working all around me teaching lessons through my friends and my parents and my teachers and classmates. I definitely struggle with pride in my life in uh, wanting to kind of be the leader of things, wanting to take charge and be in control and that that's not what we're called to do on earth. So being able to talk about that and see that week in on the mission trip, working together, seeing that pride really didn't have a place there. I've been working on that, coming back home. The moment I stepped back and slowed down and actually opened up my Bible and listened to what God was trying to say, he told me something. He very clearly knew that I was struggling with pride and taught me a lesson about it. I'm working on becoming less so that I can see more and hear more. And every time I have to choose God over what I want to do, it's definitely a tough choice every second of every day. But I know that when I let God take control, it's going to end up better than what I had planned. <laughs>